it all started when I was nine years old and I watched um, a German Titanic movie and uh, I was very affected by these pictures, by uh, the tragedy that happened. And that was the beginning, so when I was nine years old. And I, I was interested all the time, but not I didn't collect or anything. So let's say it really all started then collecting when I was uh, studying in Ireland. And when I came back, uh, I was involved in an exhibition in Austria for children where I made a little Titanic corner. I had a few things that I wanted to put on display just for me in my apartment. And everything was full because it was a very little apartment. And the only place where there was space um, was the toilet. So everything was on the walls and all the books came into the museum. It grew and grew, the collection grew, and so I had the idea to, what about making the world's smallest Titanic museum in my toilet? I don't, I don't want to be too serious about it, uh, but still very respectful. It's a very thin line to, to walk. I'm starting now not buying everything, because I want to keep it that small. I mean, the advantage is it's six meters high, so there is plenty of room. <laughs> My approach is different and it's it's the, the special place and uh, the special thought behind it. And it's not my, ga my, my goal or my aim to have the largest collection.